Hello, I'm Sarah, a genetic counselor at Ann and Robert H. Lurie Children's Hospital of Chicago. I'm going to talk to you about genetic testing for heart disease. I'll explain the process for getting the test, what results we might find, and what testing could mean for your family. The process for genetic testing involves a discussion with your doctor, advanced practice provider, or genetic counselor. If testing is right for you, you will provide a sample, such as blood or a cheek swab, from which your genetic information can be analyzed in a laboratory. The results take several weeks to come back. We typically start with genetic testing for an individual who is known to have heart disease through a test called a gene panel. It's best to start by testing someone with heart disease because we have the highest chance of identifying a possible genetic cause if one exists. A gene panel spell checks multiple genes at once which are associated with heart disease. There are a few different results which might be found from the genetic testing. The first is a positive result. This means the test found a pathogenic or disease-associated variant in a gene which is known to cause heart disease. Positive results can confirm a diagnosis for an individual with heart disease and might lead to changes in your medical care. We can then offer testing to other family members to determine who is at risk for heart disease. Some people will have a negative result. This means the test spell checked all of the genes on the panel and did not find any misspellings or variants. It's important to note that a negative test does not change a person's clinical diagnosis and they should continue to follow up with their cardiologist. We would still recommend clinical cardiac screening, such as an EKG and echocardiogram, for close relatives, but we would not recommend genetic testing for them. The third type of result we may find is called a variant of uncertain significance. This means the test found a variant or a change in a gene, but it's unclear if this change is associated with disease or not. This result alone will not change an individual's clinical diagnosis or medical care. Genetic testing may be considered for close family members to try to better understand the meaning of this genetic change, and cardiac screening would still be recommended for them. As you can see, genetic testing can be an important tool to gather more information so we can best care for you and your family. Additional information about genetic testing will be reviewed with you by your medical provider or genetic counselor, and you will have time to discuss any questions or concerns before moving forward with the test. Remember, we are here to support you through every step of this process.